Shifting your attention onto some weather-related news this evening, now over 440,000 people living across Sri Lanka are suffering at the hands of a crushing drought. A majority of those affected are in the northern and eastern parts of the country. This is the devastation caused by the drought in Kiran Batiklo. Farming is the main livelihood of the people living here. These farmers have no water for agriculture and no water to even quench their thirst. With the wells in the area drying up and the lack of drinking water in the area, the situation has taken a turn for the worse. When the news first team visited the area, many cattle in Kulawali and the Pal of the chain of villagers were seen dead. This has resulted in a major blow to the dairy industry in the area. The residents of these areas have already abandoned over 275 acres of farmlands due to the lack of water for their agricultural activities. We do not have water to drink. We have no way of feeding our children. We have to walk for miles in search of water. We can't find water to drink. We travel a long distance to get water. The sun is setting on the Mawatuan village in Batikolo. The heat and the warmth is excruciating. Do not be deceived by the greenery, the green farmlands that you see behind me. The farmers that you see here who are standing and waiting will not come to this farmland again because they know that without the water that they require to cultivate these fields, they will not be able to have a good yield, a good harvest. So this will be the last day that these farmers that you see behind me will arrive at these farmlands. They will now give up their hope simply because they've lost a battle with nature. For the News First team, I'm Saturang Hapuarachi, reporting from Mawatuan in Batikalo. 8,004 people of 2,446 families have been affected by the arid weather in the Batikalo district alone. The Disaster Management Centre put the number affected in the eastern province at 152,936. Over 190,264 people have been hit by the prevalent drought in the northern province.